what if what if you could build apps create videos or debug code right from your terminal for free meet google gemini cli the ai tool blowing up in 2025 hey tech to ai fam welcome back to the channel where we make ai super easy for everyone today we're diving into google gemini cli a free open source ai tool that's like having a coding genius in your terminal whether you're a beginner or a pro this video has got you covered with a step by step guide to download install and use it plus we'll create a cool app and even a video stick around hit that like button and let's get started so what's gemini cli it's google's latest ai agent launched in june 2025 that brings the power of gemini 2.5 pro to your terminal think of it as chat gpt but for coders and creators with a massive 1 million token context window perfect for big projects it's free open source and works on windows mac and linux you can code apps debug errors organize files or even generate videos with google's vo3 model and get this you get 60 requests per minute and 1000 per day no credit card needed All right, let's get Gemini CLI on your computer. It's super easy even if you're new to coding. Follow these steps. You need to get to this Gemini CLI home page. It's easy. Just type Gemini CLI and you'll get to this page. I will share the link in the description and pinned comment also. Click on try now. This will take you to the GitHub repository. Scroll down. Here you'll be seen instructions for installing Gemini CLI. You need Node.js version 18 or higher. To check if Node.js is installed or not, open your terminal, Command Prompt or PowerShell on Windows, Terminal on Mac or Linux, and type Node-V. I've already installed, so it's showing Node.js version 22.17.0. If you don't see this, you may have to install Node.js. Head to Node.js.org, download the latest version, and install it. Takes two minutes. Now, open your terminal, that is Command Prompt or PowerShell, and enter this prompt. Let me copy and paste it. It. Press Enter. You will see Gemini appear. Hit Enter again. Now Gemini CLI is installed. Next, we need to log in using our Google account. You can also use your Gemini API key or Vertex AI, but that won't be free. So just go ahead and select Google account. You can use the arrow keys to select your preference and hit enter. A browser window will pop up asking you to sign in with your Google account. and just like that we logged in to explore the available commands type slash help this will display all the available commands in gemini cli along with some handy keyboard shortcuts now to start a new project i prefer creating a new folder maybe in the downloads folder and naming it cli this folder is currently empty right click inside the folder and select open in terminal now type gemini and hit enter we're ready to work In your terminal type cd my project to enter a project folder Oops it says 
Looks like the directory CLI slash my project does not exist. Let me enter the prompt again. Now it says it can create the directory for me and is asking for permission. Yes, allow it this time. It has now created the My Project directory inside the CLI folder. To start the project, type Gemini. I'll type create a simple to do app using HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And just like that, it has created the app and generated the index file. Check out this to do app it made for me. Now try this prompt, Gemini. Generate an 8 second video of a cat's adventure in a futuristic city using VO3. Hmm, looks like VO is available only in the paid subscription. Yes, no video generation in the free tier guys. Next. I placed a demo image in the CLI folder. We need to type add to specify the file and Gemini will show the files present in the CLI directory. Place the demo image and type something like create a replica of this image using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. And here it is. It has replicated the image. Amazing. Here's the image I provided. Apart from the color difference, everything else is just perfect. You can also organize files. What I'll do now is open Gemini in this folder named Mix. This folder has some random files. I'll ask Gemini, can you organize all the files in this folder by type? Like place different file types in different folders.
Here you go. It has organized all the files. PDFs, docx files, images. Everything is neatly sorted. Isn't it like having a super smart assistant right in your terminal? A few pro tips. Use clear prompts. Like, explain this code or generate a Python script for best results. Run slash tools to see all built-in tools like Google search or file reading. Create a Gemini.md file in your project to set coding rules like use async await. If you hit limits, Grab an API key from Google AI Studio for more power. Check the description for a link to the Gemini CLI GitHub for troubleshooting. That's it, tech to ai fam. Now you're ready to rock Gemini CLI like a pro. Which feature are you hyped to try? Coding, debugging, or video creation? Drop a comment below, hit that like button, and subscribe for weekly AI tutorials. Thanks for watching, tech to ai fam. Let's make AI fun and easy together. Stay awesome and clear that.